from unemployment is often more difficult for disabled Americans. Well, with live theater set to return, Queen's Theater has uh, launched an initiative to help the disabled have a better shot at making it in the industry. Suzanne so Gooden has a closer look at the program. It's the first of its kind in New York City. <laughs> A program created to help the disabled community excel in the theater world. Greg Mosgala is not only the director of inclusion at Queen's Theater, he's also an actor with a disability. You may recognize him from Andre Day's Rise Up music video. I was born with cerebral palsy. Um, you know, until this work began in earnest with Queen's Theater, I didn't know of another space in New York City. According to the Harvard Political Review, one in four American adults has a disability of some kind, making them the largest minority in the country. Yet they're also the least represented in the performing arts field. And 95% of disabled characters are played by able body actors. There's a phrase within the community, uh, nothing about us without us. Don't have a conversation without, uh, you know, about us. Don't plan anything that involves us. If we, are, we don't have a seat at the table. That's why the Queen's Theatre is on a mission to put an end to those systemic barriers. They began an initiative called Theatre for All four years ago that's led to many success stories. Alejandra Ospina went from being one of the original actors in the program to being employed as an audio describer. Audio describers describe what's going on visually for people who are blind and visually impaired. And she's fortunate to have the best of both worlds. I was able to record my first professional audio book. So that is definitely something that I feel like keeps me in the acting family. The workshop is normally held in person, but due to the pandemic, the two-week intensive program is being offered virtually to people 18 and older at all levels of their career. Movement, speech, voice, and scene study are just some of the techniques being offered. The ultimate goal? To give them the tools, strategies, and tactics to participate in the professional world of acting. We do give them access to uh, industry professionals, uh, so they have a chance to talk to agents and managers uh, currently working, and there is a uh, showcase and a sharing at the end of the program. But the most important takeaway? You belong here. There's a space for you here. You are welcome here. And that in itself can have such a huge impact. I'm Stacey and Gooden, Pix11 News. That is pretty fantastic. Good, good program, right? Yeah, no question. All right, let's